Can they pay you? They print money. <laughs> they print, they print our dollar bills. They, you know Chase Manhattan Bank that just took over so many banks? That's owned by David Rockefeller, who is Mason, Luke, Illuminati, everything, right? right? ABC is owned by him, NBC is owned by him, CBS is owned by him, Shell is owned by David Rockefeller. Wow. Mobile is owned by David Rockefeller. Wow. BDT is owned by David Rockefeller because he owns Verizon. I mean, uh, Vi uh, what is it? Viacom. So he owns all of this. And his son, Johnny Rockefeller, meets Jay-Z and said, hey, let's start a record label. So Johnny Rockefeller says, for us to get in bed together, you have to be a Mason like me. Right. So he introduced Jay-Z to being a Mason. Woo! And now he's finished his third degree, he comes out with an album called The, the Blueprint 3, which celebrates his third and final step into Mason as he's now a master Mason and a saint, full-time saint worshiper. Wow. Wow. Let's go to Revelation the Senate. Wow. Good work, Pastor. You too. Everything. You name it, they own it. Who do you think pays the United States military budget? David Rockefeller. You think our military is, is, is controlled by our government? You have lost your mind. The U.S. government does not own the, uh, the, the treasury. That is a separate bank. Yes. That governs the United States and how our 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 our, our uh, percentages for our homes, the values of our yeah. homes, will go up and down. Yeah. That thing controls the Federal Reserve. Yeah, Federal Reserve Bank. Which is, of course, about as federal as Federal Express, right? <laughs> it has nothing to do with the United States of America. <laughs> so the whole thing is control over money, control over people. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Control over minds through what? Television, music, yeah, yeah, yeah. all of this is, is what? Right. So you raise your hand, I want to go to heaven. And Satan says, I created everything in this world for you not to go. Right, yeah. right. Because I'm going to influence you to go to hell. Yeah. In everything that you do, yeah. every song you listen to, I'm going to tell you, lay down, lay down, baby, oh, don't worry, it's not fornication. I'm going to, when you watch a movie, I'm going to say, put as much Seventeen. 
Hallelujah. Praise God. I got to show you something. This is Learning Day. Amen. At Soldiers for Christ. Now watch. I want to show you something. 1948, Israel was rebirthed back into the world, right? Amen. Am I right? Amen. Okay. In Hebrew, 19 stands for perfect order of what? God's redemptive plan. Perfect order of judgment of God's redemptive plan. Why 48? Because there are 48 constellations in the sky. Right. So the 48 constellations tell you what? That's God's redemptive plan. Yeah. 1948, yeah. Abraham is born. After Adam, Abraham is born in the 1948th year. Yes. Wow. Israel kicked out of this land for 2,520 years. But Israel was rebirthed. The fig tree is back in this land. What year? 1948. Perfect order of God's redemptive plan through the stars. Now watch this. See, no, let me do it in Hebrew. Let me do it in Hebrew. Nimrod. 